Welcome back. You know, a lot of people are seeing this at Omaha Metro bars. Yes, I'm kind of talking about the big line of beers here, but also this white tag that says local kind of highlights that it is made here. Pay attention to that because many bars are actually cooperating to promote their local beers. As Alex Hassel found out in depth tonight, there's a lot of good local beers to say bottoms up to. You'd be surprised at the amount of ways you can use up old beer. Yes, right now you're looking at a beer slip and slide. <laughs> Cans can also double as bowling pins. And in cereal, why not? Brickway Brewery inherited a lot of old commercial beer with its Beer Amnesty Week. Owner Zach Tremert invited customers to bring in old beer in exchange for a free six pack of one of his beers he brews himself. Because once people try our beer, they go out and try everybody's beer and vice versa. Uh, when the, you know, people see that shelf, the shelf is wide and full of craft beer. And when they try one, they're like, wow, that's pretty great. Let me try another. More and more, Omaha is making a name for itself as a hot spot for beer lovers. Another popular place to find the good stuff, Infusion Brewing Company in the Benson neighborhood. It just opened a couple of years ago. The beer here is so popular, owner Bill Baburek already plans to open another location. There's a huge push towards um, supporting local products. We're seeing that local pride. Local pride and local beer. Leave Infusion's tap room and in the back you'll find the brewery where they make over a dozen of their own beers they keep on tap. Breweries like this are popping up all over. In Nebraska we've almost doubled the number of breweries that we've had um, in just about four years. Head on over to Farnham House and you'll find more than a dozen microbrews they make themselves as well. Before setting up a brewery in their basement, owners Tony Thomas and Phil Doerr passionately made beer as a hobby. There's so much more flavor in these beers. and a lot of diversity. It's not just domestics they specialize in, they also brew their own Belgian and German beers. The brewing part of it, it's, it seems like there's a lot of art to it, trying to figure out exactly how to make the right flavors meld. All of this beer comes with a lot of passion. Tremert at Brickway says he actually went to Scotland to get his master's degree in brewing. Yes, that actually exists. With craft brews taking off, he's especially happy to be along for the ride. It's because people love flavor. So once people start the uh, exploration of craft beer, you try another beer and another beer and soon you realize that beer is this huge category. And as long as the fresh new flavors keep coming, local brewers agree, so will the customers. Alex Hassel, WOWT 6 News. Local brewers say microbrews are becoming even more popular all across the world. They say we'll be seeing even more microbreweries popping up here in the metro as well. Watch out for more local beers coming out in bottles as well.